Oh, they're Quantico. <laughs> Real funny. Well, we're heading back to Quantico. You mean Quantico. Get it yeah, right. You said it wrong. <laughs> Idiot. <laughs> Howdy, folks. Welcome on back to you, me, and the TV. And it's time to start a new season of The Sopranos. Oh, shit, that's right. A yeah. new season. I forgot. What happened at the end of last season? Everybody died. Everybody died. No, that was lost. Um, I said that because I can't remember. Richie got shot by Janice. Yeah, that was like the episode before the season finale. Tony got the and his fever dreams mm, they revealed killed that pussy was pussy. Yeah, they killed a rat. pussy. Like he knew subconsciously for like the last probably six nine months that pussy was compromised. Yeah, and then finally his fever dreams really, told him the truth, solidified it. Yeah, and then he went to find some evidence, found it, and then him, Polly, and Syl had to take care of business. Yep. Sadly, they were all torn up about it because they're, they're childhood friends. That's friends. Yeah. yeah. So what's going to happen this season? More mobbing around. Uh, you don't think he's going to go legit? Nope. Nope. All right. Well, should we jump in and find out? Yeah, let's do it. Let's do it. But first, like, comment, and subscribe. Thanks for hanging out for all previous five seasons of The Sopranos. We're on to number six. Now check out our Patreon link down below if you want early access to our videos. Full length commentaries or access to polls to help us pick what we watch next. Link's down below. Check it out. <laughs> You're such an idiot. <laughs> We also have Twitter and Instagram. So if you want to follow us at You Mean the Movies, you can check it out. Or not. Or not. Let's watch The Sopranos Season 3. Bumpensiero was crucial to the Webistic stock fraud case. Mail and wire fraud, especially if the mother testifies in exchange for immunity. Come on, whose own mother's gonna testify against him? I say focus. Oh, his mom might. <laughs> yeah. Richie Aprile, exactly. No doubt about it, the cartel had him whacked. Yeah, <laughs> close. Cartel Janice. Surreptitiously enter said premises and leave without notice. This is a sneak and peek warrant. Correct, Your Honor. First, when the home is empty, we enter to take sound levels, determine where to best place the wire. There's not a better homes and garden store. Happy hunting. Oh, geez. So they can get just a warrant to get in the house without their knowledge to wiretap? That doesn't seem legal. The judge said it is. Stasiu Wilsilius. I'll run that by anti-terrorism, just for laughs. Carmela's gone. <laughs> the maid and Tony and everybody that's got a key to the house. The daughters of Columbia lives in the dorms. She went to Columbia? Yep. Unit one, this is Control. Baby Bing headed your way. Copy, Control. Baby Bing. Bada Bing. Unit two, you got Bada Bing headed your way. <laughs> Wouldn't you think that they have cameras at their house? I guess maybe it was before yeah. camera security systems were a thing. Good song. Oh, it's a mashup. It's a weird place to get your stuff dry cleaned. What? It's a weird place to go to dry cleaning. Yeah. The pork shop. Like she wanted, and reinforced the hem. Shouldn't have torn like that. Beautiful. <laughs> Why was it torn? I wonder. Why would they be wet? I got no f***ing idea. You go to public bathrooms? You stand at the urinal? Oh, come on. Oh. On the solo. You see this on TV? I gotta watch TV to figure out the world. <laughs> Even if you keep your shoes tied and you're not dragging your laces through the urine? Oh, shut the f*** up. <laughs> You made your point. <laughs> You're ruining my appetite, Seal's thinking. Yeah, this doesn't seem legal. 51. Who was born first? You were spoon. <clears throat> Philip was my kid brother. 
He killed him, right? Yeah. <laughs> Couple months before you came over. You big mouth. That was him. Yeah. Don't it happen that identical twins a lot of times? <laughs> you want to commit suicide? Tie your shoes and have a bite of Brajol. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Ed. Hey. This is my friend I was telling you about, Adriana Laserva. Ed Restuccia. Oh, yeah. Trust for the occasion, I see. <laughs> but you're in luck. Birgit here is taking over for me. How wonderful. Her name's Birgit? Nice meeting you. Take care. I'm just wondering how that girl's gonna run and play tennis. I think she'll be fine. Big house for three air conditioners. Whoa! What position? Douchebag. <laughs> so Junior's not playing sports anymore. Are you swimming before? <laughs> it's only like half an hour away. It's just this transition. It's a lot of work. Yeah. I feel like Meadow's gonna run home. Maybe. Who wrote the Star Spangled Banner? Martin Luther King. <laughs> that baby's gonna blow. <laughs> oh, it's a shame that we can't warn him. Okay. Now you see that lamp there? We're gonna make a lamp? Oh, they're Quantico. <laughs> Real funny. Yeah, you're gonna get such great detail from that picture. When's this puppy going in? Tomorrow. You better get done then. I mean, make no mistake. Part of this guy loves you. But it's gotta be hard coming into work every day, looking right into the eyes of the guy you know ordered your brother whacked, and even having to smile. It's a twin thing. Hmm. Perhaps. Hitting it. She just likes looking at her tits too. I don't mind. Okay, let's just focus. It's like a ball vacuum cleaner. Sweet. I can't do this with you. Okay. The maid called. Something's wrong in the house. What the maid find? Or did something go wrong? Water heater blew up? I don't... <laughs> <laughs> they underestimated the water heater blowing up, huh? Well, if they have to remodel their basement because it's got water all over it, feds aren't going to be able to bug them. Ten years. Yeah, save the pictures. The no front. Look at this. That's why in basements you don't put things that you really love on the floor. Well, we're heading back to Quantico. We got a job in Denver day after tomorrow. You mean Quantico? Get it yeah, right. You said it wrong. <laughs> Idiot. <laughs> Probably you should. They're in them. Pardon? For this neighborhood, they're a little different, that's all. Well, we'll get busy in the back. What, the only Italian family? Why would she, like, try to tell the elect electrical company that they're on the in the mob, right? Like, I don't see him, but I see an arm, a piece of a robe. It could be Tony. He's eating sugar pops. Corn pops. Anyway, I told John, I says, look, let's talk downstairs. 
You gonna piss in the pool? Well, you gotta go, you gotta go. But the guy says less than Harpo Marks. Next Tuesday. The wire drops a definite go. I think Harpo Marx didn't say anything. <laughs> That's the point. He's saying he says less than Harpo Marx, and Harpo Marx says nothing, so he says absolutely nothing. Sign wires cut. Didn't they cut it last time? They reattached it so the alarm was back on. Listen to this now. Hi, Yay. Hi. 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 I have the same underwear. Hi, Caitlin. Hi. This is Hunter. She's failing out of school already. Think so? I went over to the health center. That problem. Uh oh. She's pregnant. This prescription for Buspar. That's for like anxiety, right? Not pregnant. What happened in a week for her? She went from partying hard to... Furio likes his Cadillac. <laughs> you put your grief behind you. Let me hear you say it. I put the grief behind me. I don't think he's put the grief behind him. You ought to bring him up to the house. You can hang out with AJ. We can get something to eat. They can go in the pool. The pool you just pissed in. Touchdown. Dig Soprano, come on, dig it! You want to join the football team? You think it's all for show? And not oh, AJ showing football, huh? You're out of there, George. Unit 3, we're in. That was a weak high five. <laughs> Limp wristed it. Two minutes, we're allowed to check back in. Hmm. That's pretty legit for wiretapping. You know, I've had something stuck in my teeth for two days now. Jesus. <laughs> All right. What do you think of our new character this season? Lamp. What on a boring job. <laughs> Just listening every two minutes <laughs> for 40 seconds. Yeah. See if it's worth their while. Mm hmm Well, I mean, what if they're not in the basement? Are they just monitoring to see if somebody's in the basement? Yeah, I know, but how are they... Exactly. Like, how are they supposed to know somebody's in the basement? they got to keep listening in. Yeah. That would blow. Yeah. What a huge resource suck, too. I thought they weren't going to be able to get in there since the, the thing flooded, but they cleared out the water, and I guess it was just... They didn't have to do any, like, damage, repair. Yeah, apparently not. I mean, it was all concrete down there anyway, so I guess just loss of whatever they were storing down there. All right, well, uh, I guess Meadow ended up going to Columbia. Yep. Did she say that in the dream? I think so. Didn't think she'd end up going there. I thought she'd go someplace else. Hmm. And now uh, AJ's joining the football team. Yeah, that's interesting. I think that will be a, a main line. Throughout the season, AJ trying to make Must the football be. team. Otherwise, why would they have brought it up? And what are they going to get on Tony, do you think? He's going to talk more business in the basement, and I think they'll get something on him? He's pretty good about not talking business, even in the basement. He's he's still pretty uh, Harpo Marks in there. Yeah. He, he's pretty uh, vague about what he mm -hmm. wants, in, even in the basement. So, of course, that was with, uh, I think, Pussy last season. Yeah. Was most of the That's time. right. He might. And he was, was kind of being vague because he was protecting himself because subconsciously he knew yeah. about Pussy. So, yeah. all right. Well, let's jump into the next episode. You ready to watch some more? Yeah. Let's watch more The Sopranos. Nobody ever puts it back. Boom shakalaka. Starting off hot. Wow, I was right. You remember the sanitation wars? Hmm. Tony have an attack and pass out? Looks like it. Tony, are you all right? Uncle Ben. What happened? Huh? 
and met his boyfriend? Well, maybe. Mom likes lavender. I'll be ready to bolt in a sack. <laughs> People say Hawks invented the genre with Scarface, but Cagney was modernity. Is he speaking English? Yeah, he's talking about movies. Hey, he's amateur. What's your background, Noel? Noah. But on your application to Columbia, you didn't check Jewish, did you? No. African American. So we do understand each other here. You're a uh, charcoal briquette, a moulignon. What now? And they don't want my son with their daughters, and I don't want their sons with mine. F you. See, that's the kind of thing I'm hoping to avoid. Comes down the stairs. You're going to say how nice it was to meet me. Then you're going to go drop her off at school, and you're going to say goodbye. Jeez, Tony. I didn't figure him for, like, a just a flat-out racist. <laughs> They're really leading. They're trying to lead here. Yeah. The meat's causing him, causing his panic attacks. No, he saw Uncle Ben in the cabinet. No, I'm... Why were they focusing on the Capicola so much? He was just eating it. Uh, there's some more there. Since you say you can't concentrate to read. I wish the Lord would take me now. Well, <laughs> Look at this. Supposed to fill these out. Twenty years, fat f nothing. Now look, <laughs> like that kind of talk. Now just stop it. It upsets me. Camilla's my return these books. She looks funny there. Why do anything if there's not something in it for her? Are her, they CGI her head on? The actress has passed. Oh really? Mm -hmm. hey, they put you on a witness stand. Cause the only reason they let you go is to get your cooperation. Why wouldn't they just kill off her character? You know, for a year, I didn't speak to you. Maybe I should have kept it that way. So she's going to be all by herself in her shots like that with a body double in her head. They're using, like, old test footage, from what I understand. Yeah. Or not unused takes of other... Like, she's said literally everything she's already said. A million different times. Yeah, 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 absolutely. No, no new words. But why? Got uh, unexpected. They didn't expect her to pass over between the seasons. Interesting. She's kind of in integral because she got busted at the end of the last season, right? Yeah. Really? Meadow, can you come up here, please? What? I need your help with this plan. Your mom's going to tell you your dad's a racist. Uh oh. Intervention. Mother died. Okay. Jesus Christ. Svetlana just called. Mop, your mother was under the covers in her nightgown. Svetlana thought she was asleep. Surprised she went so quietly. <laughs> I break promise to you, Tony. It does not often happen with me that these old ones get away with something. <laughs> Granny remembers books you bought her when the kids were born. She never touched him. <laughs> What's your beef? And Robert Frost. He's got the same kind of lamp in his room. A little newer, though. Hmm. House. The sleep of death. The big sleep. He's talking about his own death. Which is yet to come, but will come. I thought black was dead. White, too. I'm coming, I'm coming. Literature. Yeah. AJ's gonna pull out the Spark Notes version pretty soon. Is Grandma gonna haunt them? Grandma? Olivia does seem like the type of person that would haunt. Oh, yeah, for sure. She's gonna hear her down the hallway. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> what do I tell my kids when their own family? Take it easy, I'll handle it. Janice isn't coming for the funeral. You may recall, Tony, that I have very good and valid reasons why I should not present myself in the state of New Jersey. Oh, Jesus, that case is colder than your tits. <laughs> but I'll pay it. 
Can I bring my fiance? F- that. One seat. <laughs> Coach. She's already engaged again. His mother died last night. No oh, what is she supposed to be like a star witness for their case? Yeah. Thing? And the Rico. Yeah, Rico. Yeah, I mean, it, it really benefited him for her to die. Ooh, honeycomb. I love honeycomb. It sounds so good. I'm so sorry to hear. What are you going to do? <laughs> he doesn't know how to handle it because he hated her so much. And he still loved her. It's going to be a hard grieving process for him. Remember, what's his name from Matrix being on the show? Pamela, she's gone. (laughs) Is that real? Hard to know. No more fires. You recognize him now? Yeah, I mean, I recognize him from uh, Baby's Day Out. Okay. (laughs) <laughs> he looks like a funeral director well, I thought maybe we'd have a shindig at the house You know After So the grandkids could You know. <laughs> you don't call it a shindig You call it a wake Then it's like a party But for dead people So it's okay <laughs> <laughs> You know I mean, It makes us look like we're unloving children Not to mention cheapskates Who gives a sh- what it looks like The woman expressed her wishes Yeah and it's not necessary for the parent to be a witness for the prosecution. It's a taboo thought, but common. So we're probably done here, right? She's dead. No more mommy issues? Unfortunately, I think they just got more complicated. Yeah. Death has a way of doing that. You want me to wear a wire? Why not? You need batteries? Is that the twin? <laughs> Like one of the, one of the heads of the family or something. No, this is weird. What? None of my childhood schoolwork or artwork or anything for that matter is here anymore. And nor Barb's. Anthony Soprano. She kept off Tony's stuff. <laughs> the FBI sent flowers. Breaking the terms of your house arrest? I got a dispensation from the marshals. She's my sister-in-law, for Christ's sake. My dad's very old, too. (laughs) (laughs) What do you want? I'm hoping that we can use this sad occasion to put bitterness and sore-headed feelings aside. You tried to kill her husband. (laughs) Hi, Uncle Jim. Hi, Uncle Jim. How's that surfboard I gave you? Ow. (laughs) <laughs> Who pinches cheeks like that? What a dick. Apparently he's got to take over for Olivia as the cheek pincher. I guess. No fires. Tony doesn't want any fires. <laughs> Guys trying to shake things up. Some bumps and bruises. They are. She gave to me as a striker. What? She know I like American shirts, and so she give to me. I didn't ask her. But those are my mother's records. They're worth a fortune to the right collector. I want the entire discography back at the house by this weekend. Is Janice going to have to murder somebody else now? Apparently she's just really taking over uh, Olivia's role here. <laughs> oh, what's the matter? After what my son did to you, oh, how can I look you in the face? What did he do now? You don't. Artie, what are you doing? Come on, we have people arriving. The so Artie already put that behind him. Well, you know, she died, so words to brings it back up. All our innocence is gone. <laughs> Somebody should find the winner, stick a pistol in the face, and say, you're not going to survive. Did you, did you see pussy there? Yeah, this is ghost. Form a circle and sit anywhere, the floor, whatever, get comfortable so that we can all be together and share um, a remembrance or a, a feeling about the woman who has brought us all here today. God damn it. 
Paulie Gautieri, join us, please. Oh <laughs> my god. Who's that? I don't know. Between brain and mouth, there was no interlocutor. <laughs> it's pretty much everybody's remembrance of her. Right? <laughs> I don't know what to say. Come on. Lay off from Janice. Move on. Why don't you say something, Janice? Jeez. She was my best friend. If anybody died or was in the hospital... I could be sure I'd get a call from Lee letting me know. She also hit you with the car. Right? <laughs> well, most of you will probably remember that I have an extraordinary visual sense. When I was a child, my mother didn't let me rest on those laurels. She... <laughs> and she's the reason I make videos today. She makes videos? <laughs> I thought she was working at, like, the mechanic shop right? or something like that. But not only that, they'd have to get all the people who ever lived, not just the ones now. So they got no proof. Chris is going deep. How much drugs did he do before this party? <laughs> what am I doing out here? Everybody's in there telling stories of her. I got a butte. Artie. Artie. Artie, don't talk about that. Mrs. Soprano may have passed, but who's the same? Oh. Is he going to blow up? Christopher's still talking. What I'm saying is... <laughs> <laughs> this is such a crock of sh**. Carmella. I'm Over a woman that we all know was terribly dysfunctional. Who spread no cheer... At all. Carmela, be quiet. This is my house. I'm she like... didn't want a funeral. She didn't want a remembrance of any kind. Why? Because she sucked. Yeah. <laughs> she wouldn't write down her memories for her grandchildren because she figured nobody loved her enough to read them. She knew there was a problem. It's going through Tony's mind right now. Oh, oh. You're thinking he, he's wishing his mom was like that mom in the movie? Uh, perhaps. Like boy in that movie. I think he was just... Mourning in his own way? Yeah. Didn't know how to mourn his mother, so he was just using that movie to help him process some grief. Yeah. All right, well, the wake for Olivia Soprano. Yeah, R.I.P. to the actress. Bummer. Mm. She was really good in uh, Naked, Naked Gun. Gun yeah. mm -hmm. Not sad to see Livia go, though. No. <laughs> she was a horrible person. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Carmela saving the day there, because I think Artie was about to explode before she spoke up yeah. and said, what are we doing here? Nobody and liked her. <laughs> she just put separated separations into everybody's lives just by stirring the, the pot. Mm -hmm. Right. All right. Well, that was kind of their. Uh, I wonder if they kind of wrote that episode to kind to, of to write off the to actress, write off the actress yeah. right? Yeah. Probably wasn't in their plans because I, I feel like she passed in during the off season. Must have between seasons, right? Because I'm I'm pretty sure most of the like her at the airport, unless they use some that because that didn't look CGI. No, no, no the airport thing last week. So. Yeah, yeah, <gasps> very obvious. So yeah, I'm wondering how much different this season would end up being if the actress hadn't passed. I can't imagine that she would have been in too many yeah. scenes or episodes. I mean, a, a couple, maybe three or four, but I think this is a fine way to yeah to wrap up that storyline. Wrap up her storyline. Yeah. yeah. She was kind of running the end of her course anyways. Yeah, exactly. So, all right. Well, what else is on your mind after that one? 
Boy, grief is is difficult. Mm-hmm. It's challenging for everybody in different ways. Um, yeah, Tony's going to deal with that for a while, I'm sure. Yeah, his psychiatrist was just giving him the silent treatment. Not even asking anything until Tony would speak up himself. So mm-hmm. I thought that was very interesting of her to just sit there and let him stew up whatever's in his brain and finally blurt it out because he couldn't handle the silence anymore, right? Yeah. But will his mommy issues continue? Always, yep. He'll always have them. Well, what should people comment on after these two episodes? Favorite Livia memory. Yeah. What's your favorite memory of (laughs) Livia in the past two seasons and a couple episodes, right? Yeah. And uh, if you have any insider information, maybe on... uh, She died. That's what happened to her. The situation, yeah. She was old. She died. Okay, yeah. Anything else? Like, comment, subscribe. Thanks for hanging out for Sopranos, the start of season six. <laughs> what season are we on? We're definitely not on six. We're on season three. Oh, wow. sh- not even close, huh? No. Are you sure? You think we've been watching the show for six seasons now? I can't remember. Jeez. Are Thanks you, for hanging around and watching okay? us for season three. Okay. Check out our Patreon link down below for early access to our videos, full commentaries, access to polls to help us pick where to watch next. Links down below. Check it out. Until next time, have a good one. Bye. Peace. I really thought it was six. I don't, I don't know. I really thought it was well, six. Well, season six is lost. That, okay, so that's where the confusion comes Yeah, but in. I don't know why you would ever confuse that with Sopranos since we just I feel like we've been show. watching Sopranos for a while. You're silly.